Now that it's officially summer, I wanted to share one of my favorite looks for this season that has just the right amount of color for day-to-day -day wear. So let's get started. Hear your breath beside Start off by priming your lids to prevent creasing or smudging throughout the day and make sure to prime your lower lash line as well since we will be applying shadows there too. Using a bright electric blue shade, apply that to the outer half of your lids making sure not to extend the shadow past your crease. And leave the inner corners bare because we'll be applying a different shadow there later. Now I'm mixing these two teal shadows together to custom make the perfect teal shade and I'm applying that to the inner portion of my lids. One of the shadows I picked up was matte and then the other had some shimmer to it so this adds a beautiful sheen to the lids. Before we go any further, make sure to blend out these shadows together by flipping the brush over and sweeping each shade over the other. Now run a blending brush through the creases just to blend out the shadows and create a softer look. This next step is what's really going to make the eyes pop. So using a metallic gold cream shadow, dab that at the center of your lids and start blending it with the shadows to give it an ombre effect. Fitting all the pieces perfectly. This should really make your eyes sparkle and should look like a gradient from blue to gold to teal. I decided to add some of that gold cream shadow along the inner part of my lower lash line just to add some extra sparkle to the eyes. The world in front of now to tie the eyes together, sweep a navy shadow along your lower lash line and lightly smudge it out. I wanted to slightly deepen up this look so I used a brown eyeliner pencil along my waterline and I actually really like brown eyeliner because it's not as harsh as black eyeliner, which makes it more daytime appropriate. It's the world. So now it's time to curl those lashes and apply black mascara to your upper and lower lashes. So I almost forgot to apply a highlight under my brows, so I used a light vanilla shadow and brushed that along my brow bone. Now the eyes are complete. Take your favorite blush and apply that to your cheeks. I'm going for more of a natural blush just because I wanted to add a glow to my face instead of more color. To finish off this look, I'm popping on a creamy light pink gloss. And now our summer ready look is complete. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I hope you're having a super fun, amazing summer and I'll talk to you all very soon. Bye!